It's been a morning where we just been waiting. Something, anything. What's it gonna be? Jacina Anderson, last night, um, before I guess she logged off for the night of Twitter, she said, you know what? I, I ain't forget about you, Ravens fans. I ain't, I ain't forget about you. And then she just left us all hanging, and we ain't heard nothing since. But we got a bit of an update on both the whole Lamar Jackson and the DeAndre Hopkins things going on. Um, but first, we got a little bit of a, I can't call it a troll, because I'm sure he wasn't trolling, but at the same time, like, Jack, look, Jack, we don't care about none of that other stuff. We really don't. We appreciate it. But you know, as Ravens fans, ain't worried about none of that right now. Let, let, let's just get into it. From Jack Settlement, he said, what I'm hearing as we are nine hours out, Bryce Young is going at one. Will Anderson is going at two. So again, all, all that stuff, like we, we ain't worried about none of that. But anyway, he said, Houston still has plans to draft a quarterback. The Titans trading to three to select Stroud is gaining a ton of steam. Again, that's cool, but we want to hear about Raven stuff. That's all we worried about right now because that, 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 that's what's been driving us crazy. But anyway, he also said, Ravens working Lamar contract to make Hopkins trade. So that's a big update right there. And, and it, it is expected because th this is the news that we expected. But even though something is expected, until it's official, that, that's when it means something. But that would make sense. Because in order to work DeAndre, and they could, they could work DeAndre Hopkins in there, but um, with Lamar Jackson, his cap hit right now is a little, a little over 32 mil. If, and hopefully when, they can come up with a contract extension for Lamar Jackson, that will be nice for both sides, both for the Ravens and for Lamar Jackson. I mean, how can't it be? Because Lamar will be getting his bread. Sure, it'll be more than Jalen Hurts. He will be next up. And then, of course, Joe Burrow and Justin Herbert would follow that. And they would end up getting more after that. But anyway, Lamar would get his bread. Ravens would keep their guy. And then the Ravens could go get another guy who is a guy that's been like that. And DeAndre Hopkins, which I would love. We all just waiting now. We all just waiting. I just been sitting back. I'm like, you know what? No, 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 no. I ain't, I ain't, ain't making no videos. I'm, I ain't making no videos to the live stream. We chilling. I'm, I'm over here playing my connected franchise mode in Madden. I'm relaxing. But then I saw this. I said, oh, okay, okay, okay. Closer, closer, closer. Of course, Rita gave us a big update yesterday saying that DeAndre Hopkins to the Ravens is close. It's close. So, again, just patience now. Patience. Now, of course, things are subject to change because y'all know the NFL. Crazy things can happen sometimes. One of my guys asked me this morning, he said, so what, what, uh, what happens? He said, I don't want to be that guy. But what happens if the whole DeAndre Hopkins thing falls through, if it falls apart? I said, well, we have to look at other options. Maybe uh, a Mike Evans, which that would be nice. I know if, if y'all remember a couple of months back, uh, we talked about how that would actually, with Mike Evans and DeAndre Hopkins, that would be like my 1A, 1B. And I know, shout out to my guy Nitro, he's been bringing that up recently too, about Mike Evans. But um, that would be nice. Then I know one of my, one of my guys, my guy JT, he said, well, what, if the, what if the Bills and the Ravens and the Cardinals, what if they did a three-team trade? That's an old like NBA style, huh? And he said the Bills, they would get DeAndre Hopkins. And the Ravens, they would get Stephon Diggs. That would be something right there. Bringing Stephon Diggs home. But, again, our focus right now is DeAndre Hopkins. And we'll see how this whole thing uh, unfolds. And it's going to take it's gonna take some patience. Obviously, it's taking some patience. But Ravens fans, like, whatever's coming for Ravens fans, whatever positive is coming for Ravens fans, we, we definitely deserve it. Because it's been a long offseason. It's been a long past three years um, as far as how Ravens have handled a certain position on the offense um, and actually how the Ravens have handled the entire offense. But another story for another day. But anyway, this I, – I feel like it's just a matter of time now before we get all this crazy news, all this breaking news and whatnot. But, and, and another thing to remember too, it has to happen – before the draft. It has to happen before the draft. 
So I don't think we're going to be here sitting at, when the draft started, 7.30, 8, around then. We ain't, ain't going to be, we ain't going to have to wait till then. We're going to know before because the draft compensation, they're going to want to get all that hammered out before that clock starts ticking. So if the Cardinals are going to be moving up, okay, if they're going to be moving, but whatever it's going to be, they're going to want to get all of that figured out ASAP. So we'll see. We'll see. But anyway, team, keep it clean. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. If y'all hear anything, I know y'all let me know. And if I hear anything, then you know I do the same. We out.